She is ready to sail upon your command. I shall give the order to weigh anchor. Uh, yes, yes, please. Hmm? You seem troubled, I feel. Have you left something behind in the forest? No, no, we're ready to go. Very well. We sail! Whoa, we sail! On command. But we're not ready, sir. We did the right thing, didn't we? Of course. Family is the most important thing there is. We all know that. And besides, there's no he's no spring chicken. It's probably about, it's probably about time he settled down. And you've got and you've still got us, Oliver. The three of us can do anything, even if we put even if we work together. I guess so. Aye! Hmm? Did you hear that? Huh? The fuck? <laughs> he must have turned his back. The fucking did you me? Are you forgetting someone? <laughs> that was an epic cutscene. <laughs> Phew, I'm poop man. You trying to leave without me or something? But, Drippy, we thought you wanted to stay back there in the fairy ground. Who told you that, man? And when exactly? I want names, dates, times. Uh, we just thought all your friends are back there. Of course they are, man. And they are very dear to me. Even the stupid ones. <laughs> But it's been, but we, but me and the, ah, oh, but you and me, I keep missing that part. But you and me have been a team now, and since we're a little, we're a little what? Fuck it, <laughs> a little bubble. I've been by your side thick and thin. Remember that. Remember what you said. You said I was your friend, and a lot of you are my friends, my companions. My brothers and sisters, my family. Eh, I'm gonna be sick. Shut it, you. What I mean is, a lot of you are stuck with me, whether you like it or not. So get, so get into your thick skulls, will you? Uh, yes, Mr. Drippy. Hmm. We we were only trying to get, trying to be nice after we heard that you that you said you were friends yesterday. Oh, so it's my fault now, is it? I get it. You don't think I've been pulling my weight, is it? Fine. I'm going to start using a little trick. I know that I'll blow your tiny minds. Trippy fi finally got his act together and now can use the Tidy Tears ability. Well, thank you, whatever that does. Heh, <laughs> I can't wait to see this. Anyway, looks like gang's all here. Shall we get back to where we were supposed to be go doing? What I said to Hamlin, the next great sage, Automata, here we come. Let's go. Let me join you once again. Oh, he has tiny tears. Now he can cry in battle. Good for him. That will definitely help you out. Yeah, something in a wizard companion. Da -da -ding. The eye of the storm. Until now, the use of this most ancient of magics was the sole privilege of the overseers of this world. Was it too much for you, perhaps? We granted you this privilege that you might finally dispose of the prophesied one. My apologies, your radiance. But uh. the boy, he has a... Unique power. The power of gayness. Or perhaps you simply lack the power to stop him. Perhaps. Apis. Forgive me. Your radiance. Majesty. Don't make me not the boy give you a cracker. Is clearly protected by the most potent of magics. Who could it be? The sage. Alicia. I had wondered, your radiance. She who was foolish enough to stand against you. You think she troubles us even now, in the present? 
The power that protects him would suggest so. But he will need more than the Sage's aid to save the world. He cannot succeed without the weapon of the Ancients, the wand wrought by the Wizard King. Monster. Hmm? Indeed. But we have no cause to fear its power. He will not find it. I have made that impossible. Making a wand disappear is the simplest of power tricks after all. You mean to say you have rid us of Mordstar? I have. The most enduring symbol of the Wizard King's rule now drifts free of time and space. Mordstar. Fashioned in the image of our own council's wands and bestowed upon humanity. Thanks for telling us this. Yet now, a mere hindrance. You are certain the boy cannot possess it? Not now, nor for all eternity. <laughs> we'll somehow find a way to get our grubby little hands on it. Monster, morning star. Onto the sea. Uh -huh. That was gonna. Can I check the smaller map? Tahiti. Ugh. Quest journal. Finally, let's see. Heartless wife. Kind of say rain, no terror. They beat the florets using frost and gather rainbow leaves. That's in the desert, I think. Create a candle cutter and show it to the girl. What does it say how to make it? Uh, have to ask her, damn it. And where is this? The Robertson Island. Swiss Family Robertson. <laughs> Robertson Island, Southern Summerlands. Shipwreck Shore, Summerlands. Yeah, I saw those areas. I guess I'll go for some monster hunting. Monster hunter! But they're cute and plushy. Why kill them? Because they did bad things. So they suffer. Hello, little mysterious thing on the sea. I'll leave you alone for now. Run! Or just stay stationary! Put on my plan! Let's see if I can plant myself here. Is there. Oh, that sounds. It's a monster over there. Is there anything at. What the? Oh, I was just tapping X. I'm like, oh, is there anything? I found a fine frock. Holy shit. This random shit. Uh, I was just tapping X. I thought there was a sparkle or something. That was a nice find. Okay. Uh, it was down at the bottom there. What is that? Oh, yeah, that must be one of the monsters. Well, save. That'd be a shame to get killed by it. After all that. Cradle of Industry. The Blubber. Was that what it was? The Blubber? Mulder Blubber. I can't really read it. Hubber Bubble. Hubber Bubble? Whatever. Beat the crap out of Hubble Bubble, please. Huh. I was hoping the flame sword I had him equipped on would probably do damage to seafood. <laughs> Alright, he damaged me. Oh yeah, that's right. Esther set on healer. So she's probably wasting MP. Whoops, I cancelled it, didn't I? Don't use abilities, okay. Don't use abilities, okay. 
Ah, get him, Mr. Bones. Die. Just taking a lot of beatings. By the way, how is the whale flying in the air? Like all the other f water creatures, how are they in the air? The fuck? Magic. That's a lame excuse. Now, there was one placed on the island shore over there. Now you can return to Castaway Cove. Ask that girl about how to make something. I'm guessing she'll tell me. To kind of wrap myself around this thing here. Almost looks like a little mighty or something. There's a sparkle there. Oh, that is a true sparkle. I should go around tapping X. Gnome beards. What? Puss in boots? Did I see that? Oh, puss in bouts? <laughs> it's funny because I need my cat guy, Puss. Puss and Belts. He's a tough one. Keep swaying up. Take down Mr. Puss and Belts. I just have to take down his little Grimalkin friends. <laughs> Aren't they technically not familiars? Aren't they the Grimalkins? <laughs> yeah. It's weird. There are slaves now, Grimalkin. <laughs> you work for us now. And they have smoke bombs. They are Grimalkins. Kill, kill! Man, this guy's a tough one. He's a cut purse. Like a cutthroat, he cut purses. Wow, so that means he slices scrotums? What the fuck? What can I say? It's a gift. It is a gift for wait, what's a gift? Winning in battle? Fighting? Being a thief? I guess that would be his gift. Okay, that's... Now, what was the last bounty? Last bounty was... somewhere. Ah, Shipwreck Shore, it's that golem thing. I remember seeing that earlier. Run! Run, you wusses! Oh, he wants to fight! Oh, sunset apparently. Maybe I can catch one of those jar dudes. Or the kipper. Oh! The psych up creatures just susceptible to damage? I'm gonna check his defense or something. Even if I've been boosting it. I'll go for the kipper, he does that sleep shit. Kill him! Yeah. Rip his guts open. We did it. We sir, ow, we certainly did. We did it. Yay! We did it again. Oops. <laughs> he just flipped up his head like a freaking coin. <coughs> Hamlin, Cradle of Industry. What does that mean? Cradle of Industry. So it's like a city? A, a, well, like, a high tech city? Or not high tech, but factories and shit, I guess. Okay, let's try this guy. 
column chances, tells me he's probably gonna have to be hit with magic or something. Okay, now, uh, let's try fireball. Oh, they're actually doing good damage, even though he's resistant. Okay, let's then try Mr. Bones. He's got fire on his weapon. Will I help? What level is this guy? Let's try the imp. He was doing good damage, apparently. He just attacks rapidly. Ow. Oh, look, guys, he seems to be looking at me. 